Welcome to a new segment called Kitchen Corrections. Um, guys, uh, if uh, you're, you're actually supposed to do is... Uh, uh, actually, uh, that's not how you were uh, supposed to do it. It's a new segment where I go after prominent YouTube chefs and uh, correct any little oopsies they might have made. Who dropped the ball in today's episode? Well, it's none other than Andrew Ray from Binging with Babish. What did he get wrong? Let's fast forward to the end of the Curb Your Enthusiasm episode. <laughs> and... Uh, he got this wrong. Taum, the Lebanese garlic sauce. How did he get it wrong and how can we make this right? Let me show you. Ah, 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 wrong button. Now, from the way I see things, I think you got two things wrong. Number one. Now, this is probably the fault of Curb Your Enthusiasm and not him, but Zanku is Armenian, not Palestinian. And number two is obviously the sauce. Now, if you look closely at the video, you'll notice that the sauce is rather jiggly, and that's not how it's supposed to be. Taum is supposed to be like butter or mayonnaise. It's supposed to be strong enough to stand on its own, but Soft enough so it can spread like this. So how do we fix this? Simple. We're gonna make a cornstarch water base. This is important because without it, your Taum, like Andrew's, will be more like this slime right here. It's gonna be so firm and jiggly that's gonna be impossible to spread. Now to make it, grab yourself a small saucepan. To begin, let's add three tablespoons of cornstarch followed by one cup and a quarter of water. Mix it together good. Bring it to a boil over high heat and thicken it up. Once it thickens over high heat, immediately transfer it to a food processor. Wait a minute for the mixture to cool down. Once it does, Add in about eight to 10 cloves of garlic minced or pureed. Add in about half a teaspoon of salt. And the juice of half a lemon. Slap on the lid and uh, give it a quick pulse just to combine everything. And with the food processor running, add enough canola oil until it's the consistency of really thick mayonnaise. Give it a quick taste test. A little bit more lemon juice. And a bit more salt. Grab yourself a rotisserie chicken, heat up some pita bread, and just go to town on it. And uh, listen, for the record, this is constructive criticism. Andrew Ray is an amazing cook, and one day, maybe, we can do a crossover. Oh, and uh, if he's watching, don't be too hard on yourself. I, too, struggle to make Zanku's garlic sauce. But keep it up, and one day, maybe you'll be successful. This has been Chase Cutting Kitchen. I'm CRJ, making cooking fun and meaning it this time. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, smash the like button. If you really enjoyed the video, become a subscriber and hit the bell notification icon. I upload every Thursday. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Oh, now here's what I like to do when I order a whole chicken from Zenku. Grab the skin, dab some of this garlic sauce right on it, and eat it. Oh, that's little Armenia's best kept secret right there.